A number of people asked about how to count percentage identity between two aligned sequences. So after you perform alignment, you would need to see the percentage of identity between the two sequences, similar to the one that you get from running BLAST. So it's, an, it's a rather easy task in Python, and you can do that using a package, or you can actually write a function for yourself. Here I'm going to use a library called Levenstein and that, that Levenstein library is quite useful. You can install the library from Linux terminal if you are using Linux or if you are using Windows and you have Jupyter you can use conda install and I'm going to show you both codes here. The code for Linux terminal is sudo pip install python levenstein so navigate to this one if you can't see it I'm going to zoom it in and it automatically installs it for you if you'd like to use it from Jupyter you can use conda install and c conda forge label cf201901 Python Levenstein. So this will install it in your Jupyter notebook. To be able to use it, the first thing to do is to import Levenstein. So you import it, import Levenstein, you just write down Levenstein here. The L is capital. And then there is a formula here that you have to follow. The formula says that you've got to write down Levenstein with the capital L and then dot ratio then you have to have two strings string 1 and string 2 multiply the outcome by 100 that's all so I have two strings here as an example both are 80 GC and ATGG, so they differ in one nucleotide. So this formula here returns the distance between two strings. So let's say we have I as identity and it's equal to Levenstein dot ratio string 1 comma string 2 then multiply this by 100 and it will return it for you you have to print it out in a way that is legible by the reader or the end user you could say print then format your print and then write down this is your percentage dot format and I let's say then you can print this out and I will write down the percentage of identity you could say this is the percentage of identity between the two sequences and I will show you directly that this is the percentage of identity between the two sequences so you can manipulate this one with similar thing and I will tell you that this is the percentage of similarity it's 71 point blah 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 however you can round this up you could say round round this and I will show you the rounded up percentage value if you are interested in rounding it up you could also use another formula or if you have the actual alignment so this is a case of an alignment this is the first sequence here in the alignment in a pairwise alignment actually and this one here is the second sequence so if you notice we have these dashes here 
they have to be replaced so you replace it with nothing an empty string so the only thing to do is to have this first string dot replace and whatever character you would like to replace it and then replace it with what with an empty string then you could perform the same procedure so let's say we have str1 and let's bring this string here we want to replace this one and for the second string we have str2 and this is equal to the same thing but let's change it a little bit now we have string 1 and string 2 it's now it's all the same str1 str2 now you could print out the percentage of identity or let's name this i as well it shows you the similarity so this is 95.83 percent similarity between the two strings so whenever you have alignment you can use levenstein ratio to see the percentage of identity between the two sequences I hope you enjoyed it and thanks again for joining me here.